Hello, this is Father, and it is August 24th for entertainment educational purposes only. We're looking at our Discord here. <clears throat> so, uh, Alto, uh, you uh, uh, may see how he's got his configuration spread out. And I don't know if enough of you guys know about the Discord, but if you come up to uh, understanding, it's under it's under the other part. So understanding like Palto's uh, how he does his TA. <clears throat> So, it's a lot of uh, information on fractals and how he comes up with them. Somehow I answered uh, in his uh, thing. So, he's describing how he finds uh, cycles and stuff. Um, it's definitely good to go through and understand, like, why, why, why he's circling stuff, and what he's put, point, he's pointing out. Um, it's uh, definitely, definitely uh, uh, worth digging into everyone's TA. So, like, let's go over to. <coughs> sorry. Uh, we all know Booksy's TA, uh, and. Some of you might know mine. Booksies is, uh, I think he's still working on some videos to put in his, uh, how to understand his TA thing, but as you can see, he's, Using some GAN fans here. Uh, I'm sure you're familiar with mine. Uh, Riley, <coughs> Riley does his TA based, on, based off of uh, Elliot Wave. There hasn't been much posted here recently because uh, well, it's pretty hard to do after this dividend thing, so been kind of crazy but he does a pretty good job of describing exactly what he's seen uh, from the LA waves which is uh, still important to get the you know to understand how he's doing it so once again you would go up to the uh, other part and uh, to understand how he's doing this. He's got several videos uh, to actually other people explain on how to do Elliot Wave uh, so you understand where he's coming from because it's really a combination of all of our TA that you should be kind of looking at, right? Just mixed in some white off there. Uh, which is totally fine because they were contemporaries, uh, Elliot and Wyckoff, uh, when they came out. I think Elliot, uh, had some pretty interesting, um, the Jello, he's, he's really new. Uh, so he's doing Wyckoff and, uh, so far, uh, we haven't got a, TA from him because uh, it kind of uh, did the drop before I think he could do anything. So, um, yeah, but he was doing some really good stuff in our general area uh, with Wyckoff. So, uh, but now 
to lead to clearly, which he's currently in our AMC stock talk, which if you want to follow us during the day, that's a pretty good place to be. Uh, if you're not watching Flixie's live stream or anything. And uh, <clears throat> what here, he's been uh, using a, <clears throat> uh, he's become the point and figure guy because uh, I talked about how terrible I was at it. And we, we went over this yesterday about how his account works. Uh, I was, I was just, uh, I was questioning him on it and uh, he pointed out a lot of things I got wrong. <laughs> so um, I'm thinking this looks pretty logical. This is actually like probably where we're going to go down to for a bottom. Um, the, count, the count works. Um, especially since uh, stock charts has updated their uh, screen and uh, I don't know if clearly he's put uh, documentation up here on how he's doing it uh, perhaps he'll uh, uh, yeah he's been doing uh, videos so uh, he tries to he tries to make it as simple as possible so you can uh, so you can really understand uh, point and figure, which is really nice because I've been really terrible at doing counts and uh, it's nice to have uh, somebody that's focused on that element of it because the counting is very important and overall and of course uh, I use a combination of like four different things in my TA which kind of absorbs. Some of, some of these people's, but it's nice to have somebody that's doing a little bit better job on uh, everything. So you got general talk, and if you want to, you know, you can come in here and listen. We share our screens. He's currently sharing his screen, um, and uh, we talk about what's going to happen. Sometimes it's silent during the day when it's watching paint, but it's you know, it's a good place to be. Um, so. On that, uh, I wanted to go over um, uh, the point and figure pattern. So it basically is going to come down to eight from this call, I think. It was like eight. Um, and that's from counting the rows sideways and then times it by three and coming down. I mean, he can go into description about that if he wants to. But the thing I wanted to point out in here, <coughs> the thing I wanted to point out about this, this thing is that on unlike trading view and most of the other things um, in here if you instead of going to PNF you can go to um, uh, sharp charts for AMC uh, which is just their version of like trading view uh, and they've already fixed it um, as far as uh, showing the correct price that we're at compared to uh, like they moved the 27 down to 21 if that makes sense they've, they've they've adjusted it to or I mean the 27 down to 17 so they've adjusted it to be proportioned to the way it should be based off of the dividend change already and as you see like this this thing is still like kind of it's holding the bottom here, but it's looking really oversold here. A lot of volume. Um, and yeah, if you start drawing lines like where you would catch, it might even be like seven-ish. You know, I don't know. It's one of those, it's really hard to, it's really hard to tell right now. Uh, don't want to go into that factor anymore, but I, or that, that, that in too much detail. Mostly wanted to show that you can actually see uh, the actual chart. Uh, our run to uh, this is 37 is actually a run to 21 on the on the actual adjustment after the dividend, right? And uh, there is some stuff on the dividend that I probably should go over uh, that people are seem to be confused by. Uh, what a preferred stock is and you can just google it uh it's probably better if you just google it then you can understand yourself but there you know amc is now a common stock and 
the ape is a preferred stock. And the best way to explain it is in the future when they want to give out extras to people that hold AMC, they'll just pay them in ape, which it's a way to make it more available shares without doing dilution. And I know that sounds weird, but that's basically what it sums down to. But the preferred stock is actually a little bit nicer because it's kind of like how you get paid, right? So, uh, so um, anyway, that's probably all I can say about that. Let's go to our normal, uh, our normal trading view. And as you see, trading view has not updated yet. There's still a gap, right? You would actually have to take this. Um, and do something to like, you know, something, something weird like this to kind of get an idea of like what it's, what it's done since it started, right? Since AMC took, <coughs> took off and it's just too convoluted to, to really, uh, you know, you can't even guess like where, you know, it's probably like right on this button here and then then you have to go back and kind of look at a three month thing, you know, and say, okay, you know, we're up, you know, like here we could catch here. So like, what does that mean in the overall picture? Until they update their chart, it's going to be really hard to, to see. But, um, I mean, basically on the, it's like we're like here on the um, uh, stock charts. Uh, version that's just stockcharts.com. It's free. You can start an account there so you can save stuff if you want to, but it's a totally free thing. I mean, you can pay have a paid version where you can get extra things, but uh, not really <clears throat> going into that. Just kind of like describing like how it's different, you know, like this this thing will change in the next couple of days to represent like what we're seeing, uh, what it should be looking like, right? So uh, what does everybody want to know? Everybody wants to know when is it going to catch? I think um, uh, clearly did a pretty good job of uh, showing that, you know, seven ish, eight ish, somewhere in here uh, to be watching out for. Uh, and what will you be watching for? Well, the volume <coughs> is already up pretty high, so it's, it's, it's hard to tell. Like, uh, Usually when you get down to a selling climax, you know, you get a lot of volume that shows you you're at the end of it. Um, but this new dividend thing is really, you know, <clears throat> there's nothing this high yet, right? So maybe kind of watch for volume. Um, it's going to be, you know, quite a bit higher stopping volume uh, on the daily uh we just had kind of a distribution sideways pattern going. So we had distribution up here, we had stopping action here, stopping action here. Uh, so you could see some type of uh, sideways action with a slight push up where they sell off again, their, their stopping action uh, to push down more. Uh, It's not a very convincing, uh, well, it does look slightly accumulative, but uh, you would have to wait to see what this does if it makes a little uh, thrust here, if it's actually ending it. But I would imagine you would see uh, something a little higher than this. It doesn't have to be that much higher to where you'll see a big dump of volume where they, they sell off or what they bought here <clears throat> to keep bringing it down. So right now I've got just a downward uh, thing. It's kind of like uh, till we get down to seven or six, um, you know, TA is kind of like, uh, it's going to be broken. And the sad thing about it is, is like uh, once we get down there, we're going to have to go through it all again, the accumulation 
So it could take, you know, months of uh, sideways action down at seven or six uh, to actually come back up. So keep that in mind. Um, yeah. Uh, the point figure is going to help quite a bit. Uh, so you can uh, kind of judge how much of a cause they're making. Uh, so uh, back to the back to our fine Discord. Um, I mean, besides besides this area, there's you know, or besides the TA people, right? You got the general TA too. You got people that uh, post TA their own TA, and uh, sometimes they do it in the our talk section, which I'm a little, you know, behind on, and then I froze up my screen waiting for it, uh, so you got Dan putting some stuff in here, um, so uh, suggestions are like, you know, something you want to be different from here, this is really where the members should be putting some of their analysis, uh, like what they see if they're not in the TA section, um, but um, it's worth it's worth. Uh, you can see Palto was doing a lot in there before we, we moved him over to the TA thing. Looks he really liked his uh, 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 his fractal analysis, and since Books he doesn't do straight fractal analysis anymore, he thought it would be great to have a fractal person in there, and. I really like Jello's Wyckoff, and since I'm not a straight Wyckoff guy, that's why I put Jello in here. Uh, Riley does Elliot Wave, and nobody else does Elliot Wave. Uh, that's why he's in our section. And um, clearly, thinking is taking over Point and Figure because he does a much better job <laughs> at it than me. And uh, I'll give him a thumbs up here because he's, I think he's right on this account. I think he's done a really good job of uh, reading up on it and, and becoming an expert at it. And he's really good at looking at the uh, chart now and, and, and evaluating stuff. So, uh, But he's been learning a lot. Uh, I've been learning from him, too, uh, in the AMC stock chart talk. The only reason I'm currently not in there right now is because I'm recording this video. And I thought it would probably be loud enough if my kid ran in or something and... Uh, and then you got dad jokes if you want to, you know, really bad uh, joke for the day or week or wherever it was, uh, you can come in here, uh, pick up your entertaining uh, dad joke. Uh, if you boil a funny bone, it becomes a laughing stock. That's humorous. Okay, so. You got that. Uh, stock requests is like, um, if there's a stock you're interested in besides AMC, or now ape uh you would post in here did somebody look at this like uh tin tuna is requesting uh these to be looked at uh then it's kind of up to one of the ta people if they're interested in help, helping them out look at it uh they'll you know they'll pick it up and uh and uh post in here the what their thoughts are, and, uh, and of course, the most important thing is a disclaimer, and, and this is where you should feel free to say anything you want in here, uh, do anything, because um, our disclaimer for the whole site is, you know, none of this is really, you know, advice, nobody's a financial advisor, nobody's telling you what to do, make your own decisions. It's kind of kind of best to know that, you know, I mean, there are rules too. Uh, I would definitely uh, uh, go over the 10 rules uh, because, uh, you know, you just want to make sure you're being, you know, being good in here, right? And uh, so, uh, yeah. It's going to be a little while. Uh, patience. Uh, there's a lot of confusion over the, the split. Um, but, you know, just hold tight. 
Be patient. Don't make any ra irrational moves right now. Um, there's plenty of time to be rational later. And then um, the one thing I also point out, I'll go uh, back to the um, back to um, our uh, TA section, or not this one, the other one. <coughs> Because it actually shows the chart um, that on the uh, point point figure version of this, like when it starts to make a, and I'm sorry, I'll just switch it over to that. So uh, you can understand a little bit better. O's mean that it's you know going down. X's are up. You have to have at least three to make a column. Uh, let you know. Uh, uh, but this also you can put in here, you know, like where uh, a reversal could happen, right? And in this case, um, you would have to come all the way up to $11 for it to reverse. So, you know, it's not going to be very likely. Uh, more likely, you'll get three X's at the most when it turns around. So, uh, so whenever it turns around, looking for like a, a dollar fifty change, and that'll be the next column of X's, and then it'll build out something like this, right? You will have X's and O's and X's and O's. And this is this is what we can feel here, uh, clearly thinking, and uh, I say uh, a cause. Right, this is a cause. It just happened to not be one to go up. Uh, from the count, you can count it, and it can tell you it. <clears throat> it can tell you how how many O's down that's going to go. It's really, 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 really helpful in that aspect. And he's doing a much better job of counting than I am. Uh, as I professed all along, I am terrible at doing the counts. <laughs> I see how he's counting it now, and I'm like, okay, yeah, I, uh, it totally, uh, it jives with the information that he, that he showed me. So, um, I would definitely watch his for, for counts, uh, definitely helpful. Uh, but yeah, I, I don't see his catching until, you know, seven or eight, maybe, uh, I think his mark was, I don't know why I can't. Uh, I have to go back to the Discord to see where his mark is, but or you can just look in his TA, and uh, you know it's important to look at Paltos and and Rileys and and uh, Jellos too, besides Oxy and I's TA, because all together, you know, one of them may catch something first. Like uh, for example, clearly caught this figure thing before because they had they had converted over right so since the 17th we've had a double bottom breakdown which means like this O and this O and this one came down below it so therefore it's going to drop but you wouldn't have had that information before because it was still skewed based off of the the amount previous amounts and now that they've fixed theirs to be like where that stock actually is from the split like what the price should have been. You can see that our bottom was actually $6 already. So, yeah. And uh, I don't know. I just thought I'd go over this for you guys this morning. Um, if you have any questions, come in the voice thing. Send me a private message. Um, also, um, uh, you know, Google preferred stock versus common stock. So you understand that Ape is a preferred stock while AMC is now a common stock. Well, AMC has always been the common stock, but uh, Ape is the preferred stock. And preferred doesn't really mean as much as, as what you think. But yeah, uh, I guess if people want me to, I could I can just do a video on it, but it's a pretty easy Google search if you don't understand. It's not, it's not complex. But on that, I'll catch you on the flip side.